Welcome back or welcome if it's your first time here. My name is Claire from Claire's Curves and today I'm going to be doing a plus size Shein try on haul which I'm really excited about. Please do like and subscribe to my channel if you enjoy these types of videos and go watch the rest of my plus size try on hauls and let's get started so you can see what I got. outfit I'm going to show you is actually the one I have right on right now. It's the plus plant print v-neck top and skirt. You know how much I love coordinated sets. I will be linking everything in the description down below. This outfit was I think around 17 euros and then I had to pay some small fees when they got to Malta. But I really like the set, especially the top part of it. The bottom, I don't really like how it looks on the midsection that much, but I can still think it's a really nice outfit. The material is stretchy and a bit thin, but not thin enough that it's see-through. I think it's flattering and the problem will even wear the top like with a nice high-waisted jeans or something like that, because I think it's really cute. Um, I got this in a 2XL, uh, if I'm not mistaken, if, if I am, <laughs> check down in the description and then have written what it is. The size was. This outfit I'm trying on is the plus ruffled trim tied backless shifty dress in a 3XL and this was 19 euros and 6 cents and let's see how it looks on from what I can see just from the packaging it's a nice dress even if maybe it does look a bit like it could be a bit see-through or a lot but we'll see how it looks on. It might have a different kind of look to it when it is actually on. Let's try it. Okay, so this definitely isn't my favorite <laughs> dress. It is super short and the material doesn't really feel that strong. When I was trying it on, I was afraid the zip might come off or something. It's super tight even though I got it in a 3XL. But, I mean, it's not too, too tight. It's more the height that's the issue for me. <laughs> because it's quite short. It's a bit see-through as well, and it's not really my style of dress, I'm not going to lie, but I hope kind of that the others make up for it. I, I think it might be a cute holiday piece, maybe if you're a bit skinnier or a bit shorter than I am. <laughs> what do you guys think? Next I have the plus floral print off shoulder top with shorts and a 2XL. This was 13.63. Now after the last one was a 3XL and didn't fit that well, I'm a bit scared of how this will look, but we'll have to see, I guess, how it looks on. The print is really beautiful and so is the material. I mean, it is thin material, but you have to think of the price you're paying for these as well. It's cute, it's quite nice. The length of the shorts. It looks like it might be okay, but I'm not sure this will fit. It might just be a, another lovely top for me and <laughs> pants, which I don't really like. But let's see when we try them on. So I absolutely adore this two-piece set. I like the print and everything in it. And this was the one I was worried about the most when I was ordering, because I thought it would be too short or too tight from around my legs. But I don't think it's too short at all, and it's definitely not too tight. It feels really good here around my legs and even around my waist and everything. So it just goes to show you, you cannot go by the looks of what you see on screen only. It's really flowy and the material is light, but it's not as cheap as the others that I had. I think it's a really good material. And if you had to get something from the clothes I've tried on so far, I think this would be the one. <laughs> so now we're going to move on to swimwear and I'm going to be trying on the plus mesh panel high neck one piece swimsuit in a 3xl this was 12.72 for the tax and charges and stuff like that but um, let's see how it looks on once it's on me <laughs> oh, <hello there. laughs> i really like this swimsuit i think it's really sexy with the mesh cut out details everywhere and i did get it a size too big i went with the measurements they had and it said I should get a 3XL, but it definitely could be a bit tighter, you know, kind of to hold everything 
a bit better. I did remove the padding because they were a ridiculous shape on the side of my boobs and were not flattering at all. But besides that, I think it speaks for itself. I think it's a sexy swimsuit and it still covers everything up. But yeah, I really like it. So now I'm going to be trying on the Plus Drawstring Front High Waisted Bikini Swimsuit in a 3XL. And this was 15.45. It looks really nice on uh, the model, but of course the model isn't my size. So even though she's plus size, she's not my kind of plus size. The material looks good. I mean, it looks like, of course, the padding is the wrong way around. The material looks like it might be a nice swimsuit. So we'll see how it looks when it's on. But so far, it's feeling quite nice. So this one looks quite nice as well on, and the top is good for its size, it is a 2X, 3XL, this one as well. Um, I left the paddings on for this one because I think they look good the way they are. But the pants, again, they fit alright, but they're not tight kind of at all, in fact they're actually quite loose here at the waist. I think I, if I could have, I would have sized down the pants. And just left the top as a 3XL. I don't know if they have that mix and match option or not. I'm still going to keep it as it is because it's not worth sending it and having it come back and everything. And it's still a nice bikini. I still like it. I still think it's really cute. That's the word actually. It's just a really cute piece. The material is quite nice, especially the top. It doesn't feel like cheap material at all. And thinking about the price I got it, I wouldn't have gotten swimwear at that price. I mean anywhere else. You have to kind of keep the the price when you're thinking about the quality in mind as well. I think it's a really nice suit and I think it fits me really well. The next thing I'm trying on is the Plus Tropical Leather Cut Out One Piece Swimsuit in a 2XL. I don't know why I got this one in a 2XL. I think it, I, it either might have been that it looked more forgiving. Ah, it looks really nice. So, in case I didn't mention, I forgot, this is 14.54 euros and it looks nice. The pattern is nice as well, it's a floral pattern. I'm not sure about the big flowers, I'm not usually a fan of big flowers, but with the cutout and everything, I think it will look okay. So let's see how it looks. Okay, so this is another swimsuit that I got. I got this one in a 2XL. You can see kind of the type of prints I like as well from the outfits you've seen today. I really like the ladder, the ladder cutouts here and here as well in this swimsuit and I just wish I had gotten everything in a 2XL because I think it fits better. My only issues with this is that there's a bit of side boob here showing which I don't find very flattering and the straps are quite loose, I'd have preferred them to be a bit tighter like this here. But I think it's still a nice swimsuit and I can't wait like, to have the tan lines of the ladder over here as well because I, I'm sure going to, surely going to be out in the sun wearing this. But yeah, I think if you're going to get the outfits, please make sure to measure correctly because either I didn't measure correctly or you need to size down in most of the swimwear. I have the last thing to try on now, so let's try it on and see how that one looks. So the final item that I will be trying on is the Plus Floral Print Underwire Bikini Swimsuit in a 3XL. This was $14.54 as well and I'm really excited to see how this one looks. I didn't figure out which one it was before opening the package, so okay, the print is a bit darker than it looked on screen, but it's it still looks quite nice. I'm always a bit scared of the cutouts here. I, I, I'm attracted to them in the sense that I always like swimsuits that have them, but I'm always scared of buying them. This wasn't the first time that I have two with cutouts here, so we'll just have to see how they look once I try them on now. The top is nice. I'm not sure that it will fit. It might fit. Let's just try it out because now I'm excited to see how it's going to look on. <laughs> so this is the last one I have to try I have to try on. I'm not sure about this one, I'm completely torn, so I'd have to have your comments down below to tell me what you think of this one. I like the top part of it, but I'm really not sure about the bottom because it doesn't come up as high as I usually like it. And these I think they sit at a part where I'm not that confident with my sides here. But the rest I think the material is nice. The top, the size is good, I think this, this you don't have to size down in, I think it's a good 
good sized bikini and this was in a 3XL as well. Right, I'm really happy with the purchases that I got today, especially the swimwear to be honest. I'm just sad that I should have gotten them in a smaller size and I went for a size bigger just because I thought that they wouldn't fit. But overall I'm really happy especially with the material of the swimwear, especially at the price that you get this anyway. So those were all the outfits I had for you guys today from Shein. I'm quite happy with the swimwear especially and I like the coordinated set, the shorts and the top as well. Let me know what your favorites were in the comments down below, your favorite swimwear and your favorite outfit. Um, for the price, I think the quality was quite good. I'm not going to compare it with high, high, high price items like ones you could get from, for example, from, I don't know, River Island or something like that. But the swimwear was actually good quality and I'm happy with the items I purchased. I'll see you guys next week when I post again, or when you'll see me. I hope you have a good week ahead, and please like and subscribe to my channel if you enjoyed this video. Bye!